Okay, hi there, and welcome back. Uh, last time we finished the Temple of Time in the Sacred Grove in the game The Twilight Princess, and we're still playing the HD version on the Wii U. Um, yeah, the boss was a huge giant ass spider. The lady wasn't all that happy with that, but uh, he's nice and dead now. And we got ourselves some new kit, so... Now we can control statues, which is kind of cool. There we go, another piece of heart. You got another piece of my heart now, baby. And... We only really have one dungeon left before we're in the end game. And that's kind of cool. But before we get to that last part, I think this episode will be one of those exploration -y ones where we basically just run around all of Hyrule and try to figure out anything and everything we can do with the skills we have. Okay, let's quit that. Let's switch to the wolfy boy there. Let's go and kill this thing, I guess. Get over here! Hi there, Mr. Wolfie Boy! Walking up the stairs. Getting somewhere. Getting there. Not too quickly, but we're getting somewhere. Walking back into the... Now, I guess? The future? I kind of like this little thing where the door opens into the past. It's kind of cool. Well done, adventurer! Woohoo! Sees what she was looking for! Goodness, yes, it's the Dominion Rod! You found it in the temple! But that thing has been around for quite some time. I can see from here that its magic has been exhausted. Oh. And I have completely forgotten the spell that would once again bestow its magic. It can't be helped. It'll, I suppose it'll I just have to look for the statues that respond to the rod. It's decided that's what we'll do. That's what we'll do indeed. Well, Uku is on her way. See you again. Bye, Uku. You strange boob chicken thing. Alright. If we can restore magic to the Mad Dominion Rod, maybe it'll come in handy. Well, it kind of already has come in handy. Cool, I guess. Right. Radio. So. I do seem to remember. Um, well, let's head on down here. Do you kind of seem to remember there being a place where we could do something, right? with our new spinner since we were here last time so let's go and have a look at that if you can't figure that out um yeah ghost there is gone already killed it no i only want you gone all right and we're here start from the bottom all right and i think if we go up here yeah, look way up there. One of those tracks we need to use our spinner. So, let's follow this around, I guess. And see where it takes us. Okay. Alright. Cool. So that takes us to a chest. Nice. I got a fucking stamp. I don't fucking care. I don't think there's anything more we can do in the Lost Woods. So I guess we'll transport or warp. Where do we want to go? Where do we go now? Where do we go? Oh. Where do we go now? Now, 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 now. We could go to the Sacred Grove. That's where we are. Let's go to South Faron. Here we are. 
kind of need to know, though. Is the Dominion Rod completely useless until we have fixed that? Yeah, does nothing, does it? Okay. Alright, then we won't go here. Because we need that thing to do what I wanted to do. We can go here and get a clue, though. Where do we go? Where do we go now? Now, 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 now. <laughs> I have come to deliver a letter. It is a letter from Renano. Well, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. Bye bye, Renato. Oh, uh, no. What's what I mean? We did get a new letter. Let's read it. There is something about Delia's memory that I wish to tell you. I know you're busy, but please come visit me in my sector. Cool. We'll do that. First, we'll go to uh, the bar, to the boob lady, and see what she has to say. Oh, you did, did you? <laughs> what did you get me, honey? And hi there, everyone else. All well, one of you else. Ooh. Ooh. That's awesome, honey. Oh, and I've gotten you something too. But you won't see it until tomorrow. <clears throat> tomorrow afternoon, to be more exact. Well, yeah, we do have a bug, don't we, for uh, Agatha? Yeah, tomorrow. Remember, my payday? I promised you would get snacks from Norway again, or I'll try snacks from Norway again. Do you have a bug? Yes, I do. Do you want a snail? <laughs> so, snail worth 100 rupees. That means we have filled up our pockets for now. Which is kind of cool. <laughs> it is not one of my. It's it's my favorite Zelda 3D game. Majora's Mask. I am still kind of hoping for a re-release on on the Switch. They could just release the 3DS version and up upscale it slightly. That would be fine by me. But I want that thing on the Switch. I also want a 3D remake of Ocarina of Time on there. That would be awesome. And yeah, snacks coming tomorrow. Or being sent tomorrow. At the latest Thursday morning. Depends a little on when I can get everything packed and things after work. Chad is in Kakariko Village now. Would you check on the children if you had that way, Link? Sure. Will do. Um, I guess... So, now we have two reasons to go to Kakariko Village. We have Renato and we have Chad. He's a real Chad, that one. <laughs> you have a good memory, little little one. Let's see here now. Let's warp to Kakariko. Let's go there. It's awesome, honey. Those pins are really cool. They make good stuff, those guys, huh? Here we go, back to being human. Which is an improvement over being a dog, I guess. And then, let's head on in inside. Well, my surprise isn't that fun, but it's, uh, it's food. And it's allowed. Ah, I have been waiting for you, Link. Fortune has smiled upon us. If things go well, we should be able to help Ilya recover her memory. Do you know Thelma's friend, Shad? Well, it seems he is researching the heavens. 
And, as I have learned, uh, when Ilya was saved, she overheard someone talking about the Rod of the Heavens, something like that. The Garden Elder believes that to help her regain her lost memories, we should piece together the fragments of her past. Which means, if we work our way backwards from the very place where she lost her memory, we may find something that will restore it. Now, we must retrace Ilya's path. I am certain it was Thelma who cared for her. But it's not, it would be best to speak with her first. Please take this to Thelma. Darn it, we need to go back to the pub. Cool. But to be honest, I cannot abide Thomas' company. We have a fighting chance, Link. Okay, cool. And, yeah. I think I need to go down here. That's okay, honey. <laughs> I really do love that pen. It's awesome. Now. Oh my, call me surprised. If it isn't, Link. What a coincidence, meeting you in an odd place like this. How very odd. Oh, hello there. I came here today to look into the Harulian legend of the sky beings called the Uku, or Uka. But to think that you would appear here with such perfect timing. You really are a rather extraordinary fellow, aren't you? I found it a long last. Observe the statue! It's the same as the one in the manuscript my dear father left me. There are many similar statues around Hyrule, but this one seems to be different. Or wait, I did my kinda geeky voice for this, right? Uh, here, uh, look at this belly. There's uh, something written here. Do you see? This too was in my father's notes. It is called Skywriting, I believe. I waken us with a word that breaks the seal. Yes, indeed, it's what it says. Wait a moment, isn't that Ilya, a friend of yours? It's simply tragic how she has lost her memory. And that rod of the heavens she mentioned. I'm sure it has something to do with a word that breaks the seal. Hmm. Isn't there any way to restore her memory? I'm certain it wouldn't help us figure this all out. Alright, let's, uh... Let's do that, then. Because we can't really go exploring or anything before we have fixed that darn frickin' rod. Uh... Yeah. He kinda does, doesn't he? He's kind of, uh... For being a geek in a game, he's kinda cool. I guess. Let's climb up, climbing on up now. Climbing all up now. Even cooler. Then tomorrow I will send your package and I'll send it. Uh, it'll be traceable this time. I didn't do that last time and that bit me in the ass, didn't it? So, um, yeah. We'll try and figure it out tomorrow. I even think I have a box ready where around here somewhere. Yeah. <laughs> I actually do. <coughs> Darn it. Now. What we need is to get back to Thelma, I guess. So, uh, out here and warp. Let's warp the warp warp warp. Take me to Hyrule Castle. Gesundheit, bitte. Sprechen Sie Deutsch. So, how's your day been, honey? Had a nice time painting all your little uh, keychains, right? There are new keychains, people. New types available. Now, Squirtles. Very, very cute little chibi squirtles and Bulbasaurs and Charmanders and Pikachus. Lady Adorables on Instagram. Darn it, you marching soldier fucks. Move out of the way. Yeah, so they'll be ready to ship out very soon then, I guess. Huh? Let's go in here. Hey! Um, do I want to see them? I would love to see them, actually. Because you bought some too, didn't you? For yourself? Would be kind of cool to see that one, at least. 
Health ones. Ooh, well, if it isn't from Renato the Shaman. All this rotten and he doesn't bother to mention a thing about little old me. Honey, that's what I call rude. Well, there's no accounting for the foolishness of a man. And at least I understand Ilya's situation now. Of course, I can lend a hand for that adorable little girl. Hmm, what else do I know? The first one to bring Ilya to this shop was the doctor. Maybe he knows something, but he's a crusty old bat, that's for sure. Hey. Ah, I got it, honey. You go ahead and take this to him. This magic little paper will get that cutter talking. So basically the bill for all of his drinks, right? It sure would be nice if you started remembering things soon, eh? Like... Alright, so we're going to the doctor's place. Ooh, that's a cool one. And you bought a shy guy. That's awesome, honey. <laughs> Is it just a normal little shy guy? Did he have the general guy? Um, doctor. He's up here, I think. That's Giovanni's place, right? I don't think we need to go there yet. You should make a general pen. Oh, that's true. Do you want to see our little felt family? Hey, cool. Thanks, honey. <laughs> One of my other favorite Nintendo 64 games. Um, yeah. Let's me, let me head inside here, and then I'll give you a little update on our felt family. Ready for felt family? There. <laughs> it is on a shelf. It's, uh, yeah, it's over by my controllers and stuff. And for now, I think that's kind of a cool little pause screen. Just as I wondered who it might be, I see it's the admirable young lad who was willing to help the Sora boy for nary a single rupee. Just what is it you want, lad? A fiscal? You've some money, don't you? By the way, that girl Ilya didn't mention anything about me, did she? He's quite a perverted old coot, isn't he? Hey, move out of the way, bitch. I'll be honest, lad, it'll cost you a fair bit for an examination. It's not that I'm having trouble making money. Not at all. Why I'm so skilled, they call me ha my hands the golden mitts. If you don't have any air in here, then be gone, you scoundrel. Did she really not say anything at all about me? Nope, she didn't. Let's show him this bill. I t l look, I can't pay this off right now. I can see Thelma hired you for of some sort of heavy to strong army, but she'll have to wait. Look, lad, if I'd been able to sell the wooden statue that the young lady had, I would have been able to get the money. But see, I accidentally spilled medicine all over that little carving which made it stink awfully. I put it outside to dry, but then, well... Okay. Look, Mr. Heavy, at any rate, neither the money nor the carving is here, so I can't repay you. Now to work, to work. Alright. And we'll head in here, head in here. We'll turn into a wolf. And we'll... I guess we'll push this thing. Okay, and maybe we won't. doesn't have its own shelf, so maybe I should actually make some sort of setting box or something for him, but yeah. Yeah, it's okay, we can forget the fish smell now. 
And then where where do we go now? No 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 no. So we learned a new smell. That medicine stench. I don't have any money. So let's head on out. Awesome day, honey. <laughs> My day's been actually been very good too, so I can't really complain, can I? So we haven't been out here much. But I do think I need to go back here and have a little smell around, see if I can find out where. Yeah, it goes here. Yeah, I'll have to spook you a little bit there, people. Yeah. Well, first day of work, always a bit of a butter, but yeah, it was okay. And tomorrow's my payday, that makes me a bit happier. And tomorrow I'll also I'll be able to go and get... Oh. You're looking for the wooden statue that Ilya had, aren't you? I think it's a cancer that I happen to know got stolen. Yes, I'll admit it. But then it was attacked by some sort of skeletal dog beast. That you thought it like me. Those fiends that are just outside the southern gate. Alright. I can get the statue back unless you give them all a thrashing. Okay, southern gate it is. Let's get to the southern gate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Scream and yell and be scared and stuff. <laughs> it's so soft! So now, all I need to do is get down here and then fight all the skeleton dogs. And, uh, oh yeah, and we can do a few things up there too. This is actually kind of cool. This gives us something to, uh, it gives us something to do, doesn't it? Skeletal dogs by the southern gate. There we are. There we are. And there's the statue. Cool. You got a wooden statue. It might be a clue that will help Ilya get her memory back. Cool. We'll try that right after we've tried something up here. <laughs> yeah, is that what she says? The little girl in... Uh, it's something with Fluffy. It's so Fluffy! Or something like that. I seem to remember. That being a thing. Yeah, we need to get up there. There we are, down here, and um, we need to, in the rear middle there, I think we need to bounce. Darn it, just barely missed it, we'll try again. <clears throat> yeah, that's what she says, that's right. I don't know, when I watched that movie, I was, I was really, really disappointed. I kind of thought it would be a movie about a guy being just a great evil mastermind and all the wacky things he got up to, but nope. It's a movie about a guy becoming an uncle, basically. Which isn't what I signed up for. Darn it, a bit earlier. A little bit earlier there, and we'll get that. I don't got that. Where is it, you my pretties? Oh, no. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I've. Uh, I'll be honest. I've never liked the minions much. My mother and my stepsister both love them, but yeah. Not my thing.
Yay, we got a fucking stamp. All that waiting and hoping and we get a fucking stamp. All right, back to Kakariko. Yeah. Too high pitched to me. Weird Turkish kind of soda juice thing to drink today. I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. <laughs> I don't know what it is. Oh, let's turn into human. Let's have that statue there. I, I am kind of missing one bottle as well. Do you kind of want that? Yeah. It's a turkey soda. I went to the Asian market with my mom the other day when we had the whole day of helping her out with stuff. I I remember something. I was confined somewhere. Yes, and I was saved by whoever was confined with me. And when the person set me free, they gave me this statue. Yes, yes, I remember that much. But that means the person is still in trouble. What is wrong with me? I can't remember where that place was. Ooh. I remember. I thought I had seen that before somewhere. That belonged to the tribe that protected the Helian royal family long ago. They worked in secret, so they lived in a lonely, forgotten place. But I heard that tribe dwindled in the prolonged wars. If you want to find that hidden village, look for a path leading to the Lanayru province on the far side of the Bridge of Illidan. But a rock slide blocked the way to the village a long time ago. All right. Oh, I do not mean to worry you, little human. Probably problems like these are not problems to Gorons. Our patriarch Darbus will be waiting for you up ahead. Look at your map to see where. I would try to find a path beyond the Bridge of Elden that leads to Lenar Ruins. Armins. Man, nipple, man, nipple. Looks like rocks are actual nipples. Yeah, it's okay because it, it's a soda, kinda, but it's also made from real juice. And I'm not crazy about the taste, but it's okay. I can I can work with it, kinda. Right? Now, where the fuck is Darbus? Starbus, where the fuck is Starbus? 24 years of waiting for a chance To tell her how I feel and maybe get a second glance But I gotta get used to not living next door to Alice Alice? Who the fuck is Alice? Oh yeah, there are actually reeds over here, isn't there? I can call it Pona, that'll make things go a bit Oh, it's orange. It's orange juice, and then with a slight sparkle to it. So it's okay. It's, it's kind of good. I think if I had it every now and again, I would get used to it. And I would actually find it very pleasant. But now, to me, it's kind of... It tastes a little bit like just flat orange soda. And uh, I'm not much for flat sodas. Twenty-four years just waiting for a chance To tell her how I feel and maybe get a second glance But I gotta get used to not living next door to Alice There was a golden bug on the floor or, or on the ground, wasn't there? Somewhere around here? Yes, there it is. I don't know what it is to make me feel like this. I don't know who you are. But you must be some kind of superstar. Darn you, die. Alright, I kind of want that bug. 
Let's grab it quickly here. Oh, nope. Don't roll over it. Grab it, I said. I think that's the grasshopper or something, right? Yeah, that's the first grasshopper. And I'm guessing there's one more around here. So maybe we should just do a little ride around and see if we can find one more. Fuzzy Bubluch. I actually kind of low-key love the Don't Mess With The Sohan movie. <laughs> it's so stupid, it's just kind of fun for me, to me. So, yeah, sorry. I kind of love a movie that's real stupid. And it's an Adam Sandler movie. There's a little, a light little spark, isn't there? Come on. Oh, am I? Ouch. All right, you fuckers, get over here. Yeah, there it is. Let's pick it up as we can. Let's just around, jump around. Jump up, jump up, and get down. I kind of like the music in the in the movie as well. Kind of very, very over the top Israeli stereotype music. I don't know. It, there's just something about that movie. It's yeah, it's so stupid. It just becomes. Stupid fun, I guess. Maybe that's the thing. Um, that may be the whole thing, actually. All right, let's jump off of this. And that thing goes. This thing is gonna die now. There we go. One more. And then I do see a little buggy bug over there, don't you? Let's have that. Let's see if that's one of the ones we're missing. I think I have both of those, yeah. That's what I thought. <clears throat> kind of just the whole thing, when he punches through the wall, right? <laughs> Again, so stupid it's just fun. You can't be mad at it, it's too stupid to be mad at. It really is kind of too stupid to feel anything about, to be honest. Um, yeah, we need to go here, yeah? <laughs> yeah. And it's a very bushy downstairs area, I guess. There's a lot of weird things in that movie, man. So, I think all we need to do now is basically get over here, and then, yeah, it's there. Jump off. We're dead. Oh, nice and deadish. I do think I need to go in here. <clears throat> I think that's the thing. Here we go. <clears throat> It's been a long time since I saw that movie. Right. Come on now. Thank you, Darvis. There's a hidden village up ahead, little human. The elders call it a forgotten place. This scent that has been burning my nostrils, it is the scent of evil. There is one powerful creature I have seen about, but under the beast... Are many minions who attack and plunder like a pack of hyenas. There are 30, no at most 20 of them ahead. They are probably just a small band of survivors, ragged remnants, who have settled leaderless, leaderless sorry, into this village. Got a little human. Yeah, cool. We'll help. Actually, I don't know. Uh, I don't know the rates of uh, the British uh, 
the British Postal System, to be honest. But we'll figure it out. I'll, I'll have a check online after we're done streaming today. And today may not be the longest stream ever. I've had a kind of long day at work. So I may take it a bit easy, just for my own kind of sanity's sake, I guess. So now, that's where we need to get. Are getting somewhere here. Oh, there's one more guy. They're gonna die. I guess. Oh, there's one in there, isn't there? Yep. There we go. Honey, you're going down. over there. Yep. So down to 12 from 20. Got a little climb up here. Let's see if that gives us kind of a vantage point to go from. Yeah, there. Let's take out those chests back there. Now where to go? Where do we go now? look in here. I think I killed everything, but it'll make me able to get up to the second floor, right? Yep. That's okay, honey. We'll figure it out. Okay, I can't see anymore, so they must be all be inside of houses then, I guess. Anyone in here? Let's uh, do see ya. Uh, seem to be someone behind here, right? We'll figure that out as we go. Um, oh! There you are! You're quite a little freaky one, aren't you? Freaky dicky! Right. I could probably use my hookshot, right? And then I can climb up? Yeah, there we go. Oh yeah, and there's that thing. Let's have a howl. Yeah, exactly. Okay, I'm not allowed to do that now. Bastard. Alright. Gotta get back in. Oh, I can just do the same little trick again, I guess. There we are. Yeah, this time we'll make sure that it comes back to me if it doesn't go to you. And then you. Okay, I gotcha. Cool. I do see you behind the window. You're not exactly invi invisible. I mean, not invincible. You're not invincible either, but you're not invisible. That's what I meant to say. Uh, Radio. Just one more, I think. There we go. 
That's all 20. As soon as we're done with today's stream, I'll, uh, I'll go have a check. And I'll, I'll also try and, uh, figure out what I should put in your little gift basket thing, right? Please, please forgive me for not opening up the door. My name is Impas. I'm the last resident of this poor village. My name comes from the Great One who built this village so long ago. This village was once the secret home of a proud tribe who served the royal family. But it fell into decline and became infested with dangerous beasts. It's become an awful place. Excuse me for asking, but is your name Link? Ah, I knew it! So then, you saved that nice girl. How lovely. When she was here, she would often cheer me up by saying that you would come to help. That sweet girl, she worried about this old woman, even as I helped her to escape from here. By royal order, I can't leave this place until a certain person arrives, no matter what terrible fate is visited upon it. Oh, listen to me, Blatheron, I have a favor to ask. Would you help me return this to her? I think she always kept it close to her heart, but even so, she didn't hesitate to part with it in order to protect me. Nice. This is the key to getting Elo's memory back. Yeah, isn't she kind of cute? I believe in my heart that it's kept me safe all this time. So please, I ask that you return it to that girl. Kind of cute little grandma, huh? As, as soon as I'm done with the stream, I'll do it. Um, I kind of want to know myself how much it would cost. I do think your prices are actually better than mine, though. So I hope that, uh, yeah. And you may have to weigh some stuff. At least the package. Anything in here? Not much, huh? Let's head on back out. Here we have another little talk there. A dear girl deserves her charm back. And tell her that it's old Biddy was very grateful. Will do, Granny. Yep. And then... Get on up here. And we'll do the last holding stone. <laughs> oh. I'll just try and find a time or a price table then. What? Why can I? Why can I not turn into the wolf? Can I? Can I do it up here and then run out? Is it because of the fence or something? Climb, climb up. Okay, don't do as I say. Not at all. Let's try this again. Climb up. Up. Darn it. Climb. Climb up. Am I just stuck in here now? to turn into the wolf. <clears throat> Is it because of the old grandma? Not here. Darn it. We have to come back. I'll run out and I'll come back in. Here? No, not at all. Okay, and then let's head in here. <clears throat> Ask the wolf. And I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to scare the old grandma, but yeah. That's kind of how it goes sometimes. You need to scare the old grandmas. And the grandmas, and the grandpas. So... We just need to get over here, right? And then through there. 
There we go. And listen. Oh, it's this thing. I hate it. Sorry, this is a bit annoying, I know. But it's the easiest way to kind of get those little markings that helps me out a lot. Oh, there's more, is there? Oh, I'll, I'll pay you. So you can send it. That's okay. I... Yeah, so sorry if you're in your on your headphones, honey. This is gonna be real freaking annoying. <sighs> okay, I, I, I kinda need to hear it again, don't I? Yeah, doesn't it? <laughs> but it's just a s simpler way to just get it because you get all of the... Get all the blue little notes that helps you figure out what you need to do. That's the last song we need to hear or learn. And I like that it gave it a little bit of extra uh, animation when compared to the other songs. Let teachings of old pass to you. Take sword in hand and find me. That's cool, honey. Take some good pictures, because you can always make more of them, right? Yeah. Yeah! <laughs> my Google Chromecast in my bedroom just started saying stuff. The stuff hidden around here is all stolen monster loot. If you want some of that nice loot, just dig around to your heart content. Okay, cool. Let's see what we have here. We got some money, 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 money! And money... And cockles and muscles, July, July, oh! Money, 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 money! Money! Wasting, wasting, wasting money! Money! Hey honey, do you wanna do me a little favor and search something up for me? Or should I do it myself? Depends on if you're on your computer or if you're on your phone right now. Kinda. Do you wanna figure out where the last bottle is in this game? Because there are supposed to be four. And I only have three. I have the one you get from... The guy selling uh, oil. I have the one you get with fairy tears in them. And I still have the fairy tears in there. And I have the one you get in the very beginning of the game, but I'm missing a fourth one. Cool. Thank you.
in my most obnoxious noise. Thank you. Now, let's get to Ilya and she's in Kakariko. That's a whack. Here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go now. Take it away, take it away, take it away now. Uh, bottles. Just uh, Twilight Princess bottles. I think you'll find it. Bottles, as in the things you have food in or drinks, right? Here we go, here we go. On a mission undercover and we're in control. Here we go. Here we go, total spice, it's on, it's on with the show. Here we go, here we go, here we go. <clears throat> there. <laughs> yes, this feels so familiar. The scent of hay. Long ago, when we were young, you and I... You were always there, you were always beside me. Yeah, the one in Fern Woods we already have. That's the one we get all in, I think. And the one in Ordon, that's the first one we got. One at the fishing hole. All right, where's the one at the fishing hole? I think that's the one we're missing. <laughs> one at Giovanni's house. Yeah, we got that from Giovanni with tears in them. Yeah, uh, the one at the fishing hole. How do you get it? <clears throat> we need to go to the upper part of the river, find the door mark. Okay, cool. We'll go do that then. That'll be our next little quest. Find the empty bottle. Ah! This gift was meant for you. It was something I wanted to give you before you left on your journey. Please, Link, take it. <coughs> You got the horse call. Ilya made this just for Epona. Set it to YX or R and use it while outside to play Epona's favorite song and call her to you. Whenever you turn, I'll be waiting for you. Hell yeah, guidebook Sarah to the rescue! Link, you remember what I was saying about the Rod of... The heavens? Well, actually, it was about the messenger to the heavens who held the rod. The nice woman who saved me told me about it. Apparently, in this woman's village, they've guarded something for the heavenly messenger for generations, so they await him. But they can't give this item away until the messenger arrives with the rod. Alright, sailing. Do you have any idea who this messenger to the heavens might be, or even what the rod is? I do. And why couldn't it tell me that before I went there? But okay. Now, uh, I do, since we have to travel anyway, I think we should go get a bottle first. You agree? And that'll also take us back to the nice, re relaxing uh, fishing hole for a little while. So we'll go there. That's apparent. Source the main upper Zora River. That's where we need to go. Where do we go now? No, 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 no. <laughs> there won't be much fishing, though. I'll, I'll preface it with that, right? We'll only fish where we need to fish to get what we need or want. I don't think we'll spend another half an hour just fishing today. It doesn't make for very good streams, does it? Just me paddling around fishing. So, fishing rod. There we are. America! Fuck yeah! <laughs> 
around us every motherfucking day. Hey, America, fuck yeah. Alright, this is the sign, right? No littering? Yeah. Do not toss empty bottles or cans here. The fish are crying. And I think I need to fish here, right? Kinda. <clears throat> Let's try that again. There are a lot of little fishies here, apparently. Let's... Let's get it on. That's a tiny little fish. Let's try that again. Let's do it again now. Whoa. Oh. What is it good for? Darn it. <clears throat> One more time. Let's see what we can catch. There we are. <clears throat> we got an empty bottle. Nice. That means we can have an extra fairy or whatever we want with us, right? And that's kind of cool. Now, <clears throat> we need to get back to that place, right? We need to get there again. And I think this is kind of the quickest way to get there. And then we'll use our horse call that we just got to call it Pona. I kind of like that we get a horse call. It makes it a lot easier to use Epona efficiently. Which is cool to me. Because I kind of actually like riding horses in Zelda games. It's kind of like when you get your first car in GTA, right? When you steal your first one. It's the freedom. Yeah. But you do know Mr. Ed was turned into glue, right? So... Eh. Maybe not Mr. Ed after all. Because he feels kinda sad <laughs> to call anything Mr. Ed since he was turned into glue. Um, is there anything here? I'm starting to. Uh, it's a kind of a weird. Right, yeah, nothing. Cool. You know what? We aren't that far. Maybe we should just beat a wolf and just run. That works, right? Let's just dash. Let's get there. Rather quickly. I think actually Buttercup was turned into glue as well. <clears throat> they did actually make uh, I think it's a, a violin bow from Mr. Ed's male and male? Mane and tail is what I wanted to say. Lots of little cats here now. Okay, I like this one. This one is my cat. Look at it. It's so cute. And there are so many. <laughs> right, so this old woman is a crazy old cat lady, isn't she? Is that girl doing all right? I haven't much to offer, but please make yourself comfortable. Let's show her that rod. Hey, that rod. <clears throat> is that the dominion rod? Ah, uh, could it really be? Are you the messenger to the heavens? 
Among the legends of my clan, there is a story from the time when the Uka still maintained contact with the royal family. Yes, it's said that a mysterious rod was handed down from the people of the sky and it was called the Dominion Rod. The rod was only to be carried by the messenger to the heavens when the royal family needed to communicate with the Uka. From generation to generation, my ancestors have guarded a book that, by royal decree, was to be given to the messenger to the heavens. This is that book. Please take it. This is a hint to finding a path to the sky. Radio. This book is written in the ancient language of skywriting. I am so glad I stayed in this village. If I had not met that young girl, what would have become of me? Meeting that girl must have been ordained by the gods, so that I could be here today to pass on this knowledge. Can I have the tiny little tortoise one? Can I have this? Just in life, can I have this cat? <sighs> no, I can't. I'm allergic. Darn it. <clears throat> yes, it eaters. I want one. Yay. I have a cat for a few seconds in my life. Okay. Stay with your parents. Can I work? Yes, I can. Yes, I hoodly diddly can. Hoodly diddly, neighbor, you know. <clears throat> Let's go and get the Dominion Rod back to its power. Or old powers, I guess. And when we have done that, that's when our little exploration starts. And we'll do that for, uh, well, half an hour or something. Just have a little look around and see what we can do with, uh, with it, I think. Here we go. Uh, my family used to have a completely black cat. It was a beautiful cat, but yeah. It's that shad fellow down there, a friend of yours, Link. I need... Huh? I need to give him my thanks. Okay. Let's head on down here. And now my mother, she has one uh, blonde cat and one black and white one. Statues, the word that breaks the seal on the rod of the heavens. It just gets odder and odder. Now Elia's memory is the last clue we have to solving this strange puzzle of the heavens. Link, what shall we do? We shall do nothing. Thou shalt read this crappy book. <clears throat> oh. You don't suppose this could be uh, the word that breaks the seal? Right, right, let's try it out. No reaction. So, it is not this statue, er. Link, thanks ever so. You have brought me one step closer to solving this puzzle. I shall give the book back to you. Now I shall try out this word on other statues. I have made the rounds of, I have made the rounds of these statues so many times that I have memorized their locations. I will place marks on your map so you can find them. And that's what we'll do. We'll actually go and find every single one. There we go. Our rod is back the way it should be. Power has returned to Dominion Rod, said the two, and swing it with X, Y, or R to breathe life into statues. When imbued with life, the statues move in the same way as their master. So he did say he would mark your map wherever there was a statue, didn't he? And we should go check out those spots. Will do. Statue thing. Okay. We'll put the Dominion Rod up there. And then we'll leave from this place and we'll go where we need to go. 
Where did you go, honey? Where did you go now? No, 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 no. Sweet child. Alright, yeah, that's a cute cat. Wish I could have cats, I can't. I can't. I can only have fish. And electronic pets. Which reminds me, I really should change the water on my fish now. They've been in there for a while. Let's see. So. He has marked some statues for us. There's one there. Nothing up there. There's one there. Right. We'll just take them one by one, I guess. Let's start with just getting a pony up and running. To make everything easier on us. Nice. Line the hole with bouts of holly. La 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 na 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 na. Right. I do remember this place, right? Up to the left, or right, I mean, not left. Let's just... Dismount this thing. Run up over here, and then we can move this statue. Come on. Let's move ya. Let's put you right there. Our cat was called Susie. That was her name. Oh. Okay. I think I need to bring the statue with me. Nope. There's the statue. There we go. Where do we go? Where do we go now? No, 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 no. Alright. So, yeah. You're there now. Oh. Almost. Yeah. There we go. And we can open this chest. <clears throat> Kinda not the same. It's not soft and cuddly. Um, right, so... That's something, I guess. You found one Sky character, a missing part of the word, blah 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 blah. Alright. Coolio. Where's our next spot on the map? Okay, so... We... you are here, I guess? And we need to go... there. Any, anything that's closer? Journey. Yeah, we can just take a warp there. So we won't do that right now. Nothing there. Okay, there are two over here, but I guess we'll warp here and then just get to those two. <clears throat> in the desert, there is one. None in the peak province. None up there. Right, so... Actually, this one is kind of our next target then, I guess. Come on, opponent. Mr. Ed, take us where we need to go. And on the way, let's just generally look around for strange stuff that might might be a heart piece or something later, right? You're not furry and fluffy, though. Soft and warm I can get, but I don't think you're fluffy. I'll buy myself a cat soft toy. <laughs> And if we were to get a catfish, I would need a much larger aquarium, because mine is rather small, actually. On purpose, I didn't buy one of the bigger ones this time. I used to have very big aquariums, but yeah, they're a lot of hassle. And I kind of didn't have a space to put it this time. When I moved into this house, I didn't quite find a place to put them. 
So yeah, fuck off, bird. Yeah, there's one over here. Whoa. Let's jump off. There we go. And then we can have you move. Let's just have you stop there. <clears throat> and we'll figure out if there's anything more cool I can do with you. But first, let's pick up this char character. character. Sky riding Skyler. You found one sky character, character thing, which can be used for basically nothing, I guess. Um, anything? Anything to do with that statue? Not really. Okay. Then our next stop would be. Yeah, it'll be there. So let's warp. Let's do the time warp. to the moon let me play among the stars let me see what spring is like on jupiter and mars in other words hold my hand in other words baby kiss me Fill my heart with song and let me sing forevermore. You are all I long for, all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. Okay, so if I put you there. Uh, okay, not the right place. Here then, I guess. I'm trying to have some fun. <laughs> Singing along. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forevermore. You are all I long for, all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. In other words, I love you. Can I go up on that, maybe? Let's see here. Can I harm you? Nope. Okay. Not that easy, but we'll get there. There we go. I got a fucking rupee, which I don't need at all. Whoop did you fuck did you? But yeah, whatever. Now, Wolf Link, take me where I wanna go. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forevermore. You are all I long for, all I worship and adore. In other words, Please be true, in other words, in other words, I love you. Alright, um, I think the statue is on the left when you turn this corner over here, so let's see. Lefty lefty, righty tighty. There we go. Yeah, there it is. I don't know what it is that makes me feel like this. I don't know who you are, but you must be some kind of superstar. Um, there's a thing over there. There's a. Yeah. 
Well, that's... Oh, nope. Dominion Rod. Oop. And head on down over here. Let it go. Let it go. There. Nope. Nope. This one. There we go. There we go. There we go. Let's fall down over here now. You know what? I actually don't want to ask him today. Too much sweet, I think. I kind of want something, um, yum, yum. something a little bit more, uh, maybe savory, I think. See what I can find afterwards. I did buy myself some snacks the other day, so maybe I have something that'll work. Oh, Dominion Rod. And let's have you get a bit in there, maybe? Let's try that. It'll be a weird angle, but, yeah. Maybe? Yeah, cool. Nom nom. Nom 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 nom. Right. Um. I do think that's everything right here. Oh, there's a rock. Hi, Rock Lobster. Death to America. And butter sauce. Boom. Big boom. I'll turn into. Uh, Beast. Okay, nothing more there. Is there anything over in this on this bridge that I haven't seen yet? Or I haven't picked up on. Oh, there's a twinkly sound. We love twinkly sounds in this game. Oh, bone arrow. There we go. And then where are you, little twinkly? Twinkle, twinkle, little bug. Come down here, give me a hug. Not there. Where the frick is it? Maybe it's on the other side. Let's have a look here. There you are. And you flew away from me. So far away from me. So far you just can't see. So far away from me. Let's put that away and let's pick you up. Come on. Be nice. Mantis. Cool. And I think I need to go. I think there may be another one on the other side of the bridge. So we'll go over there. Don't kill me. I'm so killing. Fill my heart with song and let me sing forevermore. You're my one and all I worship and adore. In other words, please be true. In other words, there we are. I think that's all of them. All the crows. Did we count them? Counting crows. Uh, yeah, they're dead. I don't hear the twinkling sound of a little bug. I guess it's over here somewhere. Huh. Let's keep moving over here. Maybe we'll find something cool. Oh, slimes. And skeleton dogs. Oh. Yeah, don't need the money. Got no money. And a few skeleton things. Ooh. Winkly twinkly, where are you? I do hear you. There you are. I gotcha. Get on over here. Thank you. That's both of the mantises, I guess. And since we're already down here, where does 
this lead? Does this lead anywhere? Let's follow the path and just see where it goes, I guess. Death to America and butter sauce! Those things do look kind of suspicious, so I'm guessing we'll need to do something with those. Okay, and there... There you are, aren't ya? Let's, let's have you nice and killed. Do you give any arrows? No. No, of course you don't. That would be too easy, wouldn't it? Oh, we could actually just... get this, right? Come on, shoot me. Shoot me, you evil bastard. Thank you. Just a few arrows. Wouldn't it be nice? So we have nine now. We'll do a bow and, bow and arrow combo. We'll pick up a few more, if we can. Yep, there we go. And then we'll go over here and we'll take care of these things. That's a ghost over there, I think. So, first things first. Cool. Now, is my hookshot enough to get over there? That's kind of the main question. Or do I need a double, double whammy? Hey, cool. Nice, honey. Yes, we are visiting Agatha. After a little while, we will. Right now, we're just trying to kind of round up the little secrets and stuff that's everywhere in this game, I guess. There we go. And then, oh, let's turn into a dog. And let's not die here. Ouch. Ouch. Hey, you, bastard. And we can dig here. <clears throat> Which is kinda cool. Oh, and there was that place right in the... Oh, darn. Um... Let's have our... Uh... anything in over there, isn't it? Yeah. Now, oh, where are you? There. Darn it. Stay still, you bastard. <clears throat> Let's head up there, maybe that helps. Makes it a bit easier for us to just... There. That's all of those. Yeah. If it work if it works using Etsy, that would be kinda cool, wouldn't it? Oh, darn it. Another Hillian stamp fucking thing. Okay, whatever. Uh let's have our lantern on. Is there anything else here that we kinda No, not really. Darn it. Okay, put away. Let's head on out. <clears throat> Just put a link to your Etsy on your- Oh! Did I see this before? Well, whatever. We did get quite a few fun things to go by going up there, so... Not a waste. Not awesome, but not a waste. Um, yeah, there we go. And then you'll be back, won't you? 
there. That's you taken care of. And then there is one more over here, I guess. Let's... Let's aim through here. There. We'll keep moving this direction. I think that's about as far as you can shoot. There we go. Where does this road actually lead, though? Uh, I've never walked this road before, have I? Oh. At least not for a long, long while. I don't think I went this way when I played this the last time. So, uh, that's kind of cool. Just exploring a bit. Yeah, that's a good idea. Then you can make stuff and just put it up whenever you don't have an order in, right? Okay, so that's just... It's just the roadway there. Over to... This area. Nice. Cool, I guess. Let's have our horse whistle. And let's... Let's get a Pona. There we go. And then we'll put the Dominion Rod back, just so we're not confused later. We haven't had a good... We haven't had... We haven't had a good luck around here, have we? So... We'll do that quickly. Just a little look-see, and see what we can find. If there's anything interesting. There we are. Uh, you know what? Let's jump off of this horse. And let's take care of the enemies. There we go. Now. I do think there's golden bugs in this area that we haven't found yet, so I'm kind of thinking we should try and find them all. Do you agree? Yeah, so am I. It is a great game. It's, to be honest, not the best Zelda game ever, but it's kind of cool. No. Um, so, this is where it came from this time. I'll just... I'll do a sweep of the outside of the field, I guess. Just a nice round sweep. And then after that, we'll do the middle part and just see what we can find. There you are, you're dead. These little things are kind of annoying. They drop little bombs. That's what the bum bags in this game is modeled after. It's the outside of these little bug bombs. <clears throat> I did actually really, really like the remake of a link, uh, no, not a link, but Link's Awakening on uh, Switch. That was great. But I do enjoy the little chibi style of it quite a lot, actually. So yeah. I found that to be very cool. There's a bug. I see ya. You're sparkly and nice. And I want ya. Let's see here. Can I get it from here? Ooh, uh, maybe? Yeah. Where do you go? Get over here. That's a beetle. <clears throat> and that's one. We need at least two, so... We'll just keep moving along here, and we'll look for more golden bugs, I guess. And we'll kill enemies, and we'll look for hidden things. So he's dead. Cool. Nothing there, I guess, so far. Um, we're, we're only missing one bug in here, I think, and there is probably a heart piece somewhere. Uh, to be honest, the Majora's Mask one on the 3DS 
wasn't all that great. They kind of did away with some things that I would have preferred they didn't do away with. For instance, how uh, Sora Link swam. Because that was kind of a great thing, but they kind of ruined it. I think there's a hidden thing here. Yeah. Let's, let's go down there. That's okay, honey. Let's turn into a human. And I do have that bottle on I. There we go. Rupees that we don't need. And a chest that probably contains a stamp, right? Um kind of too spot on sometimes. And probably some rupees. Oh, there are more chests there. What's in them? More rupees. I'm already here. I may as well open everything. Just in case there's something cool in one of them. But yeah. The Majora's Mask 3D remake on the 3DS. Um, it was okay. It just wasn't perfect. I would, I would have loved it to be perfect, but it just wasn't. It was okay. Nice. Now, let's keep moving along the edge here. And I think we've almost made a full turn around the whole block, right? Yeah. Ouch, bastard. Let's finish him. Um, and yeah, that's the full circle. We haven't been too much in the middle now, so let's go towards the middle. And have a look around there. Oh, there it is. I see it. There's the bug. Let's pick you up. There we go. And we are actually starting to complete our beetle collection. Oh, we're just missing the one beetle. And that's the female ant. Cool, let's check where we can find it. Are you still okay, honey? Nice. So, we'll need to go back to Kakariko to find the last bug, but then we have each and every bug in this game, which is kind of cool. So, yeah. We haven't been up there yet, so we'll go up there. We just have... Oh, look, see here. Looky, looky what I found. How do we get in there? Um... Oh, yeah, I saw it. There's a thing up there, isn't there? Yes, there is. Now, over here. Down here. And up here. <clears throat> Darn it. More money that I don't need. How to get back out. Okay, there's another one. Go. Let's head on down here. Stand here, and then let's... There. Nice. Nice. Very nice. Money, 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 money. It's not that money is useless, right? Because we do have that special armor that we could actually put on. But, yeah. We just haven't yet. We haven't got any use for it. Finish. They're gonna be... Let's head on up here. <clears throat> We are kind of exploring at a good pace, though. Um, yeah, finding some stuff here and there. I don't think there's much up here. I don't think there's much up here. 
Nope. So I guess our last stop <clears throat> on our little exploration would be Kakariko again. Wait, 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 wait. We need to go to the forest as well. And then we can go to Kakariko. And then to Agatha and then to Kakariko again. Yep. First forest. Yes, we... Oh, yeah, and here. Okay. <clears throat> I forgot there was a statue out in the mess as well. Hey, so far so good, honey. But you never know. It might still fuck up whenever <clears throat> it wants to, so... I'm not taking it for granted. And I do see the statue over there, so we'll just run straight ahead and get to it. Come on! We are. And then we'll turn into a human. And then we can do this, right? Yeah, that should be it to pick up the statue's secret, I guess. Oh. Well, if I jump straight and hit the, hit stuff, that would have worked, but yeah. Whatever. Try it again. Okay. Need to bring it a bit further towards me, I guess. Here. And then we'll figure out how to get over there, I guess. There we are. Money, money, money must be funny in a rich man's world. Ah -ha. All the shit you could do if you had a little money. Okay, let's try and put it there. Let's see if we can do this. Is there a way for us to do this? Or is it gonna be a pain in the neck? It's gonna be a pain in the neck, isn't it? I can almost sense it, but okay. Is there any way for me to get up? No, of course there's not. That would have been too cool if it was easy and stuff. Get over there again. Quit. I guess we need to go over to the other platform there. There, thank you. Now. We kind of just need to be careful. Bring this along as best we can. There we go. Put that in. This will take a little while. Sorry. Sorry. As the Canadian says. We're sorry. Uh, yeah. Let's let's not take any chances, right? Let's actually get it in a little notch that it looks like we are supposed to put it in, right? Is that about it? Yeah. That looks cool. That looks nice. There and then there. And then you guy. You need to there. With there. Oh, camera. Stop fighting me all the time. I don't like fighting cameras. I don't want to party all the time. Party all the time. Party all the time. Is that about it? Yes, it is. Cool. Let's try that. Please, camera, don't fight me now. I don't know. I hope it's anything else. Even money is better than stamp. Because money is at least potentially useful, right? A stamp is just a real fucking waste. Um, let's have a quick look around here. Any 
ghost so I can see. Oh. There is a ghost over there, isn't there? Let's run head over there. See what's there. I don't want to see what's over there. Where do we go? Where do we go now? No, 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 no. There. Back into human. Up there. That away. Oh, yeah. Let's go there. And yeah, we can get up there. Cool. Let's grab that too when we're here. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Got a puzzle. So I do actually know that down here there's a cave we can do, but it's kind of a whole fighting thing where you need to. Yeah, it's a pain in the neck. I'm not gonna spend my time on that. I think for this game. I'll look around. And the other ghosts I can see from here. Not really. Okay. I guess the last four is probably down there in that cave then. Because we've gotten everything that's out here. Oh! Warping, warping time! Let's do the time warp. God, I love your stupid jokes, honey. Let's go there. <laughs> Where do we go? Where do we go now? No, 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 no. What's that over there? Is that up? Oh yeah. Um, this is not where I wanted to go at all. I went the wrong way. Warp. Nope. Oh, I know, honey. <laughs> Your jokes are awesome. Nerdly awesome. There we go. South Far on Woods. There where I want to go. Let's try this again. And then... Ooh. It's getting hot in here. So let's not strip. Transform to human. And then, finally... And this is kind of finally, because we <laughs> I've been waiting for this for quite a while. We can finally go to um, that area, and we can use the statue, and we can get up where I wanted to go all along up the trees, right? Uh, over by the oil selling guy. We've been there like four times, I guess. Three or four times. I think this is our fourth, by the way. But this, this is our fourth time here. Uh, yeah, moving on here. And then... We need to move a statue, so we'll do that, and we'll put the statue in that hole over there. We'll put the statue in the hole. Let's pick up the... Let's pick this up first. Another sky... Riding letter. This is a crucial clue to finding the path to the sky. Right. And... Oh, there it is. There it is. Come on, come with me. Come to me, my little child. Thank you. For that explanation of how to get where I need to go. What? And then I guess I can... Right? Here we are. And where does this lead us? <laughs> That's a hard thing to do when you have chubby cheeks.
there. So, finally, I could get up there. We did get a hard piece out of it, so that's kind of cool. And I think we've explored basically every area now, pretty thoroughly. Except for maybe parts of the Peak Province that we still need to go back to. And a little bit of Sora's Domain, I guess. And there are a few little mini-games that we still need to do. Maybe that'll be uh, an episode in and of itself, right? Where we just do... Where we just do weird side things, right? Why? There is supposed to be an abandoned house somewhere around here. Oh, is that a ghost up there? How do I go up there? Let's do it. Let's head up top here. And I think there was a ghost up there, and we'll pick it up as we go here. Do da dum dum ba dum ba bum ba bum ba ba da bum. Okay, and then I guess we can climb up here, right? Come on. And then go out here. And then we'll turn into our wolf form. And up here, I guess there's a ghost somewhere. Yeah, there it is. There's a ghost there. Come on. Finish him. There we are. Nice. I don't know how many we, ha how many we have now, we but we do have quite a few, actually. Uh, what's here? Nothing, nothing important, I guess. Just some money. And then, yeah, up there. There is one more. That's just what happens, honey. Kinda cute, though. Um, is there anything in here I need to... It's not here, I think. No, it's not. Let that outside. So, um, inside of one of the houses, we are supposed to find the last ant that we need to complete Agatha's kind of bug collection thing, right? And the bug collection did help us this time. Uh, often, if you do it too late, the money is basically for nothing. But we did it early enough this time around that uh, the money actually came in handy with uh, getting everything done and stuff. So that's kind of cool. Whoop! Nope, up. Hey, camera. Do the thing you actually... I actually want you to do. There we are. Oh, nope. Up again. Here we go. Let's end down here and see if that's where the... I heard a blinky sound. And... There? Yeah. That's the ant we want. Cool. Now we can head back to Agatha. Creepy crawlies. You know, there are, there are actually people who kind of get turned on by the idea of laying around in a lot of bugs. There's a lot of weird fetishes out there. Uh, yeah, we have everything there. There's nothing there. Yeah. 
Nothing there. Yeah, so... I think we'll head over to Agatha. And hand in the last bugs. That, that'll be kind of cool, right? Just finishing off that side quest completely. And I do think we get something from it. So, uh, let's see here. Need the uh, transport warp thing uh, there. And then over to Castle Town. There we go. There we are. Turn into Link. Because we can. And then head into town to find Agatha. Hey. Mr. Long! Frog! <laughs> Greetings, Mr. Long! I have come to deliver a letter! It is a letter from Shad! <laughs> Well, my business has concluded. Onward to me! <laughs> right, let's go here. And you know what? We could actually spend a little bit of money. Just to figure out where more heart pieces are. Should we do that? We, we have a lot and we are going to get even more. So I, I kind of think it'll be worth it. Just visiting this old pack. There we go. So, tell it. I would like to love some, know something about love. Oh. Where the hell is that? All right. We'll uh we'll figure out where that is the last next time, I guess. Maybe do just a heart hunt when we're done with the kind of final dungeon thing. And we'll do a little heart thing, just getting as many hearts as possible. Or he sticks it up his bum. There are a lot of bugs here now, huh? Have you brought bugs? Yes, I did. Here we go. The ant. So we have a pair. What else? Yeah, you have all six of them. I wish I could just give it all to him, but uh, to her, but I can't. I need to give it to him. To her, one at a time. <laughs> 50 rupees. Yeah, I, I know. Five bucks left. I'll give them all to you. To make you happy. There you go. Another hundred rupees that I don't need. Yeah, I don't either. And I think actually that's one of the differences from the Japanese version and the international one. That she is a lot older in the Japanese version.
Yeah, there is a lot of discussion. She's a bit too Lolita, right, to be 10? And kind of oddly proportioned to be that age. Yeah, whatever. The other grasshopper. And he can't squish them because they're all alive when she gets them. But two bugs left. Yes, I do have a bug for you. I have a beetle. Well, most 10 years old, 10 year old doesn't, though, do they? So, yeah. Tends to happen just a little bit later than that, to most. And to some, never at all. Little bit, little bit, I want to use that shiny shell as a pillow and fall asleep. Oh, this means all the bugs have made it to the ball safely. <laughs> and everyone has a partner today. Oh, look so happy. You worked very hard. Your efforts will be forever be passed down in the insect kingdom, brave knight. Please accept this declaration of honorable citizenship and the memento that goes along with it. I got a giant wallet. So now I can hold 2,000 rupees, and she just gave me all the rupees. Which is kind of bullshit. Right. Oh boy, I'm happy. I'm surrounded by bugs. Here, listen. Can you hear the happy calls of the bugs? Kinda can. Do you kind of seem to remember there being some sort of little cutscene or something? Heading back down, heading back out. Let's leave. <laughs> I th thought that was early bird, not early boobs. You listening? I'm only going to give you this advice one more time. If you don't like bugs, then you're better off not hassling her. And I do like bugs, though. This is kind of cute, though, isn't it? With all the bugs just flying and apple dancing around. Do you have your window open, honey? No. We'll warp to Kakariko. Can't do that in town, I guess. Um, ouch. We can go down here, though. And here we can warp. Seem to remember. Yeah. Cool. And back to Kakariko. So now, turning into human. Um, how many hearts are we actually missing? We're missing one, two, three, four, five, six. One of them is from the next boss that leaves us with five. And then we do have two, five times four. We're missing a lot of hearts. Well, you'll find it dead on your floor sooner or later. That's kind of the sad thing about it, right? He's very interested in that ancient statue. Let's go down to Chad. He's quite a Chad, that one. Let's speak to you. Alright, so... We did actually put some more words in that book, right? So maybe we can show them to him. Is this that book from last time? Huh. 
Are there more letters in the word than the last time I looked at us? And let's see. Now this must be the word we need. Yeah. Do that, honey. I tend to leave them for the spiders. It has taken on the same shape as the other statues. And I thought we had solved the last riddles. Blast, how confounding. I must apologize, Link. I need to cool off a tad before I mull the problem further. Yeah, you go mull. That's okay. I'll do this. And I'll make this statue actually move out of my way. Move, bitch. Get out my way. Get out my way, bitch. Get out my way. And in here we have... <laughs> cool. Yeah, I usually find spiders kind of cute, in a way. Link! How in the blazes did you move that statue? And what's this? Oh. Amazing! Spectacular! This must be the Sky Cannon! I read about it in my father's notes. I knew that my intuition was onto something when it led me here. Hmm. But how can we use this to get to the sky and city in the sky? Uh, yeah. Stunning, I feel almost nervous. Right, let's hear what Midna has to say. I cannon, huh? Maybe we could warp this to Lake Ilya? Ah. Perhaps I am in your way. Well, forgive me for not realizing. I should just disappear at times like this, really. So, uh, let me know the results another time, Link. Cool, thank you. Ah, yes, let me give you one last piece of advice. That seems to be broken, so you do well to show it to a cannon expert first, I should say. Farewell. Why is there a heart, honey? <laughs> just a colorful heart. Gotta get in touch, gotta put in a heart, baby. Uh, yeah, let's... I, I kind of just want to have a quick little look around here, that there's nothing we've missed. No. No chests or anything. So. Warp it. I want to warp it to... Oh, that's not it. It's there, right? Like Helia. Can we bring it with us there? Yes, we can. Aha! Uh -huh. Well, I haven't seen that one before. <laughs> That's why I was kind of curious. Right. The cannon goes there. And we do know someone who loves their cannons, don't we? So let's head on over to him and see if he can help us. Hey, buddy. So, uh, is that yours? <laughs> buddy, I never thought you'd get so hooked on fantastification that you'd try to build your own cannon. So, uh, are you gonna give me this or what? Looks like you have a serious rig over there. Oh, it's kind of a uh, retro, huh? And uh, there's no ignition device, so you can't even use it. Listen, buddy, I suppose I might be able to fix it for you. I mean, uh, maybe. That is, if you can pay me 300 rupees in advance. Nope. Always, because I think this thing would pack a punch. Yeah, it would send you sky high. Let's try that again. I, I was kind of hoping that... Trying to deal with them would be... Make it a bit cheaper for me, but yeah. Probably not. Then we finally have something to use all that money for, though. So that's cool. Um, yep. I want to repair. Yep, fix it.
You just want a normal red shy guy? I can do that, honey. <laughs> I'll make you a little shy guy for our felt family. Oh, my neck is real crooked today. There we go, buddy. All working as it should, I think. It may look like junk, but this thing's got some powerful innards. Are we going to be knocking on the door to heaven? Seriously, bud, it might be rough. So I'm um, sorry for soaking you for the dough. I'll leave you alone then. <laughs> well, you just have all the fun you want, okay, buddy? Cool. I kind of like that sad clone. I don't know why, but I do kind of like it. Um, is there anything else we can do here that we haven't done yet? I don't think so. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll go to the sky. And we'll stop there. Ooh. And here we are. Up in the sky. Digging a class is high. We'll take a look. It's in a book. Reading rainbow. Reading rainbow. I can do anything. Um, since you came all this way, I guess I can give you a tour of the city. Cool. Eek. Yep. How is that for an awesome looking enemy, huh? And yes, there are more of the disgusting Boob chickens. There's a dragon raging outside the city walls. And there is a shop, which is kind of cool. Boob chicken, boob chicken. Oh yeah, I remember. There's uh... It's windy here. And let's head on down to the bottom here. Started from the bottom, now we're here. Bombs. Cool. Anything else down here? No, I think that's it for this little area. But it is kind of cool that we just... Oh, yeah, there's one more chest. Cool. Let's open that too. Rupee. Okay. Well, we did just use 300 rupees to get here, so... Getting 20 back? Not a bad thing, I guess. Uh, oh. Sorry if you're on your headphones, honey. There we go, that thing's dead. Let's head in here. This place is kind of cool, right? Oh, I'm sorry for your earlier adventure. Oh, but you're planning on working around the city and taking it in, right? I'm worried about the others, and this is never good. Thing. So basically, she can warp me back here whenever I want, which is a little bit cool. Um, what do you have for sale? So, um, I do need a few arrows, so let's buy some of those. We do have an empty bottle. Potion, blue potion. Yeah, I don't think I need that. And, you know what? This is where we end today's stream with this kind of cool little image of everything in the, sh in the store here. And uh, we'll keep going from here next time. I'll see you guys then. If you're new to my channel in either Twitch or Facebook, subscribe or follow. And then, yeah, hope to see you later. Bye.
Thank you.